Are so, you sure it's on? Yep, it's on. So to make the next fractal level of a 64 tetrahedron grid, we have to take a big star tetrahedron and plug it into the triangle. Plug it into all the triangles <coughs> So of vector equilibrium. So show me how we do that. So if you look closely, like in this is in this triangle, take out the red part, just look at the blue. So if you look at the blue, that could actually be a point of a bigger star tetrahedron. Yes. And it is a point, the point of the bigger star tetrahedron. Yeah. So that's how it works, right? Yeah, and then you and then you can just keep on going with that. You put another vector equilibrium about around that one, and then use what the big part of a, a big part of that one to make an even bigger point for a star tetrahedron, and it goes on forever. Okay, so if we Doesn't zoom, it? Uh, yeah, it does exactly. So if we zoom out on this, on this, um, on that star tetrahedron, which part of it would we see? If we couldn't see so much detail, would, would it appear as a blue tetrahedron or a red tetrahedron? You mean the bit, the point that we see? You just showed me where you where you would ins show me where you would insert your next big star tetrahedron. Right here. Okay, so if you step back and you weren't looking at it, if that didn't look like a star tetrahedron, but rather it looked like a tetrahedron, what color would it be? Blue. Good. You'd only see the blue. What, yeah. You wouldn't see the red at all. Yeah. It, and right. what would you see on the bottom? On the Can bottom. Can you point, point to the bottom and say what color? Oh, it would on be? the bottom. Um, point to it. Okay, good. That would be. That would be a red. I think. Yep. Yes, that would be a red. Show me the next one. Can you the show next me? One? There, there's eight. Can you show them to me? Well, this one would be red. Okay. Um, this one would be blue. Good. This one would be red, mm -hmm. and this one would be blue, Good. and then just like that, this one would be blue, and this one would be red. It's a pattern. Thank all, you. All blues and reds. Thank you so much. And does the next big refractal level touch the middle, touch the very center of this also? Yes, actually. Okay. So every fractal level also touches the center, and it includes the smaller ones, doesn't it? Yeah. Thank you so much.